Hello, hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Landing Site AI tutorial for beginners. With Landing Site AI, you'll be able to create a website in no time. All you'll need to do once on Landing Site AI, you're going to go over to the top right hand corner and you're going to tap on Sign Up. After selecting Sign Up, you'll be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you'll be able to create your login by using your email address and creating a password. Once you have done that, you'll be redirected to this page and all you'll need to do now is enter your business name. Then from here, you can type in a business description or better yet how you would like your website to look. So for example, I would like Landing Side AI to create a portfolio website for me to display my artwork. Once you have typed in your description of your website, you're going to tap on create your website. Then from there, you're going to give it a few seconds and you can see choose a template. Let's say, for example, I would like to use this template. After you have selected the template from here, you could enter in your business address and phone number or you can tap on skip at the top of the page. Once on this page, you can choose to either wait the 30 seconds or you can enter your email information and tap on notify when finished and you'll get a notification email when it is created. But you can see right there it is finished so we are going to tap on let's go. After you have selected let's go you'll be redirected to the editor page. So at the moment this is how my website looks. So you can see how my portfolio website looks at the moment. Now to start editing it is quite straightforward. All you'll need to do is tap on the section that you would like to edit. It is actually one of the easiest website builders to use. So all you'll need to do is tap on the section you'd like to edit. And from there, you can ask their AI designer to modify this element. Or you can choose to upload an image. So you could tap on upload an image. Or you can tap on swap in image and from there you can click on another image to swap. So you could scroll down and you could swap it to this image for example by simply tapping on it. And you can see how it looks right there. So I'm going to be swapping it back. So I'm going to tap on swap image and I'm going to swap it to that one. Also when it comes on to editing the text you can simply tap on the text box. Now when it comes on to editing text all you'll need to do is select the text that you like to edit. Then you can tap in the section right here and you can type in the information and tap on Ask AI and it will change it. If it is a case that you like to change the text size or you like to change the font, you can do that also. And to edit the button, you can tap on the button and once again, you can type in and ask the AI. And you can also tap on the button and you could paste in the link that you would like to redirect persons to. And if it is a case that you like to add an element that you don't see, you can tap on the plus in the top right hand corner and from here you can type in the section that you would like to create. So let's say for example I would like to create a gallery section so I could type right here what do you want and I can type in gallery section. So let me do that then tap on generate. After you have tapped on generate you are going to give it a few seconds as you can see it is being created. You can see right there, it has now created a gallery section. And from here, you can choose to edit the section by simply tapping on each image. You can choose to either replace the image or upload the image. And you can continue scrolling down and editing each section. It is as easy as that. So all you'll need to do is simply use the AI feature to edit it. To view all pages on your website, you will tap on home in the top right hand corner. And to add a new page, you can tap on new page. Then you can type in the type of page that you would want and tap on bill and the AI will create a page for you. It is as easy as that. Once you're finished, all you'll need to do is tap on yes, next step. After you have selected yes, next step. From here, we are using the free plan. So we are going to tap on select this plan. After you have tapped on select this plan, you can see switching your pro stock images to free and I'll tap on OK. So you can see right there, it has switched all of them to free. Now all we will need to do is tap on publish. After you have selected publish, you can see the domain name that we have gotten right here. And you are going to tap on publish the selected domain. 
and you can see it is being published right there. Once it has been published from here, you'll be able to share your website link so you can see how our website looks at the moment. And that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.